What is up guys, welcome to another video and today we are here playing something a bit different and I'm pretty sure you've probably never ever seen this game before. So this game is called X Module and think of it as Wipeout with concept cars and customization. Usually I wouldn't really make videos about indie games. I've made one or two in the past. I made one about I think what the one called Drift Stage. That's a really good game and I'm still keeping my eye on that. Um, and this game actually the, de the developers of this game came out to me and reached me and they said why don't you make a, a video on our game. Now I don't think you understand the amount of shit games that I get sent asked to make videos videos on and I say no just because it doesn't really interest me or doesn't have anything to do with the channel but this was something that really kind of interested me obviously a it has customization and um, so that's an obvious plus now I want to be a hundred percent transparent with you guys the developers did reach out to me and give me a kind of a review test beta copy of the game uh, and asked me to make the video but that's as far as this video goes I'm not being paid or anything all these opinions are mine if I think the game's shit I will say that the game is shit <laughs> but anyway with that being said we're gonna go ahead go into quick race and go into player one now I've noticed there's a few problems um the controller doesn't work on the menus I, I, I don't know why so that, that's a slight issue but regardless this game is still pretty goddamn cool so I did quickly go through the cars and stuff just to see what it was like and there is a lot of customization in this game so obviously you get to pick between all of these ridiculous cars I kind of want to have something which looks relatively normal so we're gonna go ahead and go with this thing I think this thing looks like most to being normal so anyway as you can see on the left they've got a bunch of customization options if we go to the front bumpers you can see there's a lot of options that's one thing I really really do like about this is the fact that there is a lot of customization and obviously I feel like games nowadays are starting to kind of embrace that more and that's really really cool um so I think what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're gonna make the main body white and then we'll make the offset color black just because that's kind of a simple color if we go to the side skirts again we've got plenty of options we can either add it add stupid things to it and make it look stupid or we can make it look pretty goddamn normal I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep it like that because that looks pretty goddamn nice already I don't really want to make this look stupid like a lot of people would make cars like this look absolutely dumb. I kind of want to make it look relatively normal. Now we can also pick the engine. So if we go ahead and skim through the engines, we can see you've got this one and that's got the quad exhaust. This one and that seems to be some type of futuristic thing. And then we've got this one which is more of like a muscly V8 sort of thing. So we're going to go ahead and keep the muscly V8. I really, really do like that one. We also have the option to do a rear bumper, but to be honest... That seems more like a roof to me. And I think we're going to go ahead and use that one. That one looks the least obnoxious. And then we also have options to do decals and stuff. But I'm not going to mess around with all that. I, I really just can't be arsed. <laughs> and that is pretty much our, like, finished car. The front of that really, really reminds me of, like, a Hyundai Coupe for some reason. I don't know why. Or the Tibrion for some people. Now, we've also got the options to change our tyres and our rims and stuff. Um, I think I'm pretty much going to keep it the same. I kind of want to make this... I don't want to make it look too futuristic because that's just not my style. Um, but, yeah, we're going to pretty much just keep that as is. Now, one thing you can do in this game, and I didn't really look into this an awful lot, to be honest, um, is you can actually change, like, your character and make it look completely ridiculous. I believe there's only, like, one character in the beta. Honestly, I haven't really look too much um but you can do all types of things to that can we make the face black we can't make a face black okay never mind i really wanted to make an alien oh we can get the cleavage out though that's that's pretty cool i would love to see the developers of this game do something like set in current times because that would be really really cool the physics of this game aren't awful they definitely need some work and you'll see that in a minute but honestly it's not awful right so we're gonna go to horizon city um, and we're gonna go ahead and do a few laps and we're gonna see how this thing is like also, also We've got a manual and automatic transmission Right, I kind of had a, a chance to read the controls, but honestly, I, I wasn't really paying too much attention So we're just gonna go ahead and see how this does now. Hopefully I'm hoping that it knows that I'm using a controller right now because it didn't before no Oh, it does know it does know okay, that's good why am I in reverse? Apparently I'm in reverse. Now you'd think that the, the controls for this and the like the physics would be really like burnout-y, really criterion-y. But honestly, the physics aren't that bad. Oh, I say that as I crash into a wall. <laughs> I think the game is on early access on Steam, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, you can check it out if you want to. Um, again, this isn't a sponsored video, but I thought I'd just point that out since they've gone to the effort to contact me and stuff. I feel like this is one of those games which is easy to pick up, hard to master. Oh my god. Come on, slide, slide. It doesn't want to slide. 
I would love to see a game from these developers or this developer. Only one person is making this game, may I point out. You know, but I would love to see a game made by this person in present day. That would be so goddamn cool. Honestly, the physics in this are better than a lot of AAA titles. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, these are fun ass physics. Like, honestly, like futuristic games aren't really my thing. But I thought with the current, like, flood of Horizon 3 videos, it'd be nice to switch it up. I don't expect this video to do awfully well, but, um, I'm, pr I'm pleasantly surprised, honestly. When I, when I originally saw the email and I was like, oh, well, I'll give it a go. Let's see what this is like. But this has genuinely shocked me. Like, the physics are genuinely really, really good. Right, we're going to go into one more race because I want to see what the other tracks are like. Right, let's go to the Hyper Speedway. Let's see what that's like. Three, two, one, one, two, three, three, two, one, let's go! Honestly, the redeeming factor to this game is the customization and the physics. Like, you don't hear me say that often about games, that the physics are a redeeming factor, and that's the reason why... Oh, for fuck's sake. Hi, oh, I fucked up the base there, boy. Honestly, like, the game definitely does need work in some areas. It's still in very early development, but this is... Something to keep your eye on for sure. Oh, 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 I've got, I'm in the slide, I'm in the slide. Okay, that was pretty goddamn cool. You'd think a game like this reminds me of Mario Kart, but it really, really doesn't. Like, honestly, I would not want to see power-ups or anything like anything like that in this game. I feel like it would be fine just as is. There's no way I'm coming back to first place right now. I mean, <laughs> I, I, when I fucked up earlier on, that was it. I fucked up the base. How do I get NOS? I don't know. I'm so confused. We are in Kush City right now. Come on, boy. Is the finishing line up here? So we did shit that time. But anyway, um, that's been it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. It was something a bit different. Honestly, I'm taking a bit of a risk by making this video because I don't usually do these kind of things. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you go ahead and hit the like, subscribe. I will see you guys in the next one. You guys have been awesome. Stay safe and peace.